Vision is the art of seeing what is invisible to others. And there are several things that you normally can't see that you can see in far infrared, such as heat sources, electrical currents and overheating wires, and gas and fluid leaks, like what we might be in your own home. Thermal cameras already exist. However, they are handheld, expensive for the given features, and some do not include the ability to send pictures, stream video, or make dynamic gradient adjustments. Our solution is hands-free, can stream video to an external source, and it's cheaper than almost any other. Over here, you can see one of our first prototypes that we've been able to build over the past couple of years. And over here, you can see a bunch of pictures of thermal images that we've taken at various locations around ground to prove that our basic concept works the way it should. Over here, you can see over here, you can see one of our most recent prototypes, which, you, which we've actually built over the past couple of weeks and are still in the process of refining. Our potential and customers include utility companies, independent plumbers and electricians, hunters and military, firefighters, first responders, the Drug Enforcement Agency, and anyone that just wants to see pictures like these. The global thermal imaging market is around $8 billion, and over 50% of it is in North America. It is growing at nearly a 6% annual rate, and by 2021, it's projected to be $10 million. Over here, you can see some of the uh, existing systems that are already out on the market, and um, including how expensive they are overall. The only ones that are currently cheaper than ours at the moment are the FLIR 1 and Seek Thermal Phone attachments, but unlike ours, those are not hands-free. I'm Seth Morris. And I'm Alexander Saris. And we are Cybernetic.